Hi there, I'm on my way to Land Rover Experience to test drive a Range Rover around their off-road course. down in time to make the left turn. Beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> it's never been tried, no. um, but unofficially, I think it I think it's been tried, I don't know if it's been done. It's just a little yeah. bit carrying on. Yeah, yeah, just nice and gentle easing in. As you get closer, you've only got a very short window to have a look at it. Yeah. And uh, faster we drive down here, I mean the speed coming down here is absolutely fine. Um, but if we're driving fast down here, you'd be shortening that. Here. Yeah, we can just about see that she has got good clearance, but just that last little bit there, she could have hit anything, we won't know about it, but we'll be fine. So I'm going to stick a little bit over to the right, uh, left hand side, sorry, where it's a little bit smooth, I'm just gently braking now, and I'm going to straighten up in line with the track there. So, hill descent control, we we always want to just come straight off the brake and, and take it down. Situations like this where we can maybe use it alongside the hill descent control, we can do a bit of braking. We can ease it down a little bit and just see what sort of grip we've got. If there's snow or ice about, you're going to lose grip for definite at times. You might as well just come straight off it. But here, we can see we've got good grip so we can keep on braking as long as we've got that grip. If we start to slide the best thing to do would be just come off the brake and let the car oh, go, try yeah, and figure yeah. it out. Um, so we, if we were unsure about it and we had grip we could ease it down very gently on the brake and just see how we go but I'm happy with my line so I'm off that brake pedal. And there we go. So that believe it or not was a relatively smooth line down there. <laughs> The, there's worse lines we could have taken. So that will go as there if you straighten up with that and ease it through nice and gently for me, please. don't want is to go through fast no. you can see that we're well within our wading depth mm. when we come back in it's quite deep water but it's well within it the faster we go the more we're going to create a bit of a wave and that could be um, affecting the track here any wildlife habitat here or other road users um, yeah. or if we're driving down you know, streets that are flooded Thank you, Andy. Go. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> there were no putting the brakes on then, was there? No. <laughs> We've officially, I bet you've it's never, been, oh, no, never, it's been, never been tried, no. um, but unofficially, I think it. I think it's been tried, I don't know if it's been done. Right. Um, but when we've, we've talked about it, hypothetically, we, we sort of, it's been agreed oh, as, uh, as a go. <laughs> so we've, that wheel's off the ground. The pressure, the pressure, yeah. That it's wheel's left. just off the ground. So, yeah, without two right. wheels. Really, so. That's unbelievable. Oh, right, yeah, properly. Properly up the It's uh, in the event of your driver becoming unwell. So, here we go. There we go. So, pulling the park brake on, yeah. It starts braking the rear wheels but goes to full four wheel braking very very quickly. Thanks to everybody at Land Rover Experience North Yorkshire. I'd certainly recommend it to everybody. If you've enjoyed the video, hit the like button and share it with your friends. Thanks again, Jonathan. <laughs>